Well, bugger me if that isn't a fancy palace. Who do I leave here again? <laughs> Is it the fancy marauder? Because <laughs> holy hell if that doesn't look out of place. I think when it comes to fortresses, said you, one of these is not like the other. Well, as we have our wonderful Blues Brothers over here staring directly into our soul with his uh, chin being clipped through with some shoulder pads, I'm uh, I'm still a little bit in the mood for getting me a Zog on my side. I, I, I like the idea of having a necromancer working for me as opposed to against me. Intent, machine, significant other. Why are there no captains? Wait, chush my mouth. There is one. How are you? Ah, cheap who? Speak to me. I will break every shield in this area. I will kill every boy. I will! Ow! I'll do it! Just speak to me! I don't need the gimmick of Velveteen Dream with getting people to say my name, but seriously, just speak to me! Nobody said you could do that. Seeing as you made my interest absolutely decline, you can follow suit! <laughs> Crackhorn the Envenomed had an amazing name! He really did! But he refused to speak, and I will not stand for bad manners in my own home. Hey, hey, hey. I was gonna do this all sneaky like, but I wanted to see the look on your face. It was worth it. Uh, yeah? H who's that? Y you understand that I brand these boys more often than I wipe my ass. I don't even know who that is, nor who you are, who you're devoted to. Is that your blood brother I just killed? <laughs> Oh, nice one. My teammate actually helped. <laughs> Even if I completely missed and broke his animation. Oh, God. <laughs> you had such a grandiose entrance. Now look at you. Anyway, as I was going to... Oh, excuse me. That dick. Do you mind? I know I said I'd give you the kill, but I was lying. As it turns out, my man. Ow! You fucking knob! <clears throat> when it comes to your little uh, attempt to your five seconds of fame, pride came before the fall. <laughs> Uh, guess the devoted should have denoted. Next to a cliff, it's not the best place to try and ambush me. Yeah! What? what the Dip, plop down a human feet, leaving tracks across Mordor. And now that I've followed them all the way here, those bloody feet are coming off! <laughs> Well, what you lack for in level, you make up for in character. Just like a uh, leech from the river, I don't think you're quite going to be able to uh, pull this off. Ow! All right then, uh, copious amount of damage has made me reassess that particular assessment. Fair enough. Oh. <laughs> uh, fucking come here. Come here. What the fuck? Dude, can I have my moment, please? Excuse me. My boy could... Oh, God's sake. Oh! Where did, what did you do? <laughs> what did you do? <laughs> Where did he go? Hello? I saw him get shot by your bolt. And then there was a ring left behind. <laughs> I mean, I was going to make a comment. It was a bit weird that he just randomly surfaced at the edge of a cliff. And next thing I know, he's got the gold medal in the bloody disappearing act. What? Did you kill him? I need to check this, excuse me. Yeah. K Grom the Gold Thief. He, uh, he left no corpse, but here it is on the, on the army screen. <laughs> what even happened? Well, I was actually going to get kind of mad at you because you kept shooting me in the back all the goddamn time. But, uh, I don't know, given the fact that you did that and you're about to effortlessly deal with this boy... Well, I mean, I guess, guess you can live. Thanks, my boy. Thanks, my man. <laughs> you safely say I wasn't expecting that one. Might I remind you, that was the boy that got brought here as a hostage. Ended up being the MVP. Right. The um, what the hell was... <laughs> the mission just start with dialogue that wasn't supposed to go off yet? Dear Lord Carnan, you are the thing that breaks the most. I say as I shoot you by accident. I'm so sorry. That's like a third of my health as well. Ah, he, he's literally just uh, got a whole bunch of them. And, and, and that's the end of that, it seems. 
He's, he's, he's just literally revived archers. He just heard about an MVP group of them, found them in the ground, got them out of the graves, and here you go. You know, if we had that ability, why don't we just go to, like, the graves of the Gondorians and end up with, like, an, an army of decent people? Oh, it's because we're not as good as the bad guy. Ah, yes. A generic Uruk is able to pull this shit off, and the boy you made the, the one true ring of power can't. Oh, of course. Uh, my, my Drake has left me. Excuse me, Karnan. You, you've abandoned me. I'm currently surrounded in your flying away? Karnan! Oh, Karnan! Thank you for coming back. At least slightly so I could grab you. Leaving mission area. Yeah, do you wonder whose fault that is? Begins with C, ends with arsehole. Yes, that is roughly how that goes when you're, uh... The size of a damn barn in the sky. I'd, I'd say that's my fault, but it's, it's a very difficult thing to be able to not be hit by the million things that have a million projectile speed. It's not really my fault. I'm Zog and his acolytes, Deathless One. You say Deathless One? Um, I don't know how to break it to you, but uh, given the quest line I'm currently in, it's, just, it's, it's not an individual anymore. There's quite a few of them, in fact. Thanks, though, for a quest that involved me killing enemies on a very vulnerable giant twig drake. Good thing they weren't using fire arrows, which, um, would have been quite easy, as a lot of them were stood next to fire braziers. If they had the slightest increase in IQ for that moment, I would have been turned to ashes. We must find him before he raises his own army. I don't know if you've been paying attention there, Mr. Supposed Bright, but, uh, that's already what he's done. That's, that's why we're killing so many people. But, uh, hey, it's a good thing you're not being paid by the IQ point. They come for Carden. Oh, really? I couldn't tell, you know, us being in her forest. No, I thought she was having a barbecue, you know, and it just got a little out of hand. Oh boy, she was a lot of fire, she would be stupid if I walked through it, but ah well, it's not gonna stop me from doing it and being infinitely all-powerful. Yeah, there's no other much you can do about that one. Destroy the totems, deathless one! Stop telling me what to do! Literally, I take out two of them, I'm 50% of the way through. I take out of the totems, deathless one! Yeah, I am two out of four, for I have already done that before your wise and wondrous advice was bestowed upon my Fucking deathly ears. Um, <laughs> can we have a slow motion replay of me trying to one for one sneak up on someone an inch away from his anal cavity and instead Talion leaps 20 feet away to someone else? How useless are you at taking orders? I wonder Keller Brimble's so bloody pissed off half the time. Cries. Seen what he's got to work with. What was that? Did you see that? One of my guys had his head pop off and he kept walking for a bit. What was that? You could say I've already planted the seed of your disappointment in me. And if you didn't have the common sense to leaf already, <laughs> then I'm afraid it's, it's far too late. The forest has been cleared. They will not be back. Neither will your leaves. What? Is she in a, ha is she in a hammock? Is she lying in a hammock? <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, I'm childish and immature. I'm, I don't know why. Seeing this proud beast just laying down and having a nap. That really threw me off. It's even sadder when you think that she's probably dying at this moment and I'm making fun of her. <laughs> I don't really care. If Zog is able to raise the Balrog, it will be his thrall. And its power will be his. Oh, you mean the useful Balrog that I mentioned not a day or so ago? Is useful? Oh, now we listen to Brett when the tree beast says it as well. Great. I look forward to walking all the way back there. Oh, no. Beast. What you're saying is, you're gonna go have a nap, and I'm gonna deal with this all on my own. Thanks. Zog is determined to raise the Balrog from the frozen lake. You mean in the same way he was determined to raise it from the lava? Yeah, it's almost as if no matter where we keep it, he's still going to get it. So maybe we should get it, or destroy it. Funny people listen to me, like when I first say these things. And we wouldn't need four more goddamn quests to get to the point of actually doing what Brett said. Ah well, as the Mario would say, ah, HERE WE GO AGAIN. He doesn't usually say the again, but Nintendo's a, a killer for sequels, so I'm um, again. Rise and join our glory! Y yeah, your, your glory of standing on a giant ice lake that could crack at any moment. Oh, and would you look at that? There were dead people already? Why did you have- Why'd you bring dead people to the party? What's your logic there? Dead wits! Hi. You will not follow the ritual! Too late. Tark or off! will rise 
but not for Sauron. He will fight in my army. Wow, that was a really twitchy animation. You okay there, buddy? You're, you're kind of like hocked up on, 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 on speed? Math, which is it? You need, a, you, need, you need to come down, right? You need uppers and downers. You've got to even them out, otherwise you're going to be up to, you're going to be in orbit soon, right? They will chant my name. Zog! 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 <laughs> oh, he's a, he's a power-hungry one. Okay, I can work with that one. Just uh, give me a minute to get rid of all your totem poles. I'll be right with you, my sugar plum fairy. I fucking hate the fact that I can't bloody parry that. That didn't work. Oh, he killed one of his own guys. I say out loud, remembering he's a necromancer. This is probably the one point where that really doesn't matter. <laughs> hey, many a busted brain. Do you think this was destroy all humans? And remember that game? I remember that game, Vault Breaker. Why don't you go play Payday then? You'd have more fun than dicking around with me. Please just give me health before I get hit. Oh, you're a kind soul. Holy hell. The walking dead is coming from the hills. <laughs> the hills have revived. Ow! I was about to pull life from death, and you ended it. He was to be my masterwork, and you ended it. This is how you die, Great Walker. Are you sure about that? Oh! Oh, finally, a one-on-one -on -one with the Great One. And I probably should have made that comment about the Balrog, him being more rock than man. That would have made more sense with, with the Dwayne Johnson reference. Can I pin you? Can I do anything to you, might I ask? Oh, hallelujah. Wait, how do you go from being stunned to being headshotted to being able to just wander around and zip tie your way with your stupid bombs? Ow. That's... That's an ow from me, Simon. Oh, come on! You said you were stealth then! Oh, well, bugger me! You know there are fates worse than death. It's why you were chosen. May I ask why it is every time I fail, you, who now has nothing to do with this story, constantly arrives? Drain Uruk to restore health. Hey, here's a hint. Why don't you provide me some Uruk to drain for health? There were none, you condescending pile of absolute... Fetid feces. You know, it's just suddenly occurred to me that uh, I could have done this the entire time. Probably should have done that a lot sooner. I need to stop relying on just me, because quite clearly, just me doesn't work. He, he knocked me off my beast, it seems. And, well, well, that there's, there's that masterful plan right out of the window, it seems. Fitting we're on the ice, because in seconds, <laughs> you froze that particular plan and put that ability on cooldown. What a dick. And by the way, are you called the Eternal because I'm going to be stuck here forever fighting you? Every time I try to roll, I just mount you like a shitting booking bronco. Nope. Ain't going anywhere, Zog. Little by little, I'll whittle. You down? Please, stop doing this. It's sending me into a frenzy, my boy. All I want is you on my side. Got you. That minorly... I, well, I wanted to roll, but you keep doing that. When you have one button for five things, believe it or not, the, the predetermined outcome is not the one that was actually wanted and desired. You know, it would have been useful. Oh, well, here we go. Got to aim nowhere near him when rolling, so my bloody proximity is up for gamble, up for chance. Ah, up for bloody vault breaking. Zog, I really like you on my side. But as it turns out, I don't think you're going to get broken, are you? I thought he actually left immediately then, and I think I would have been devastated by that. Kanan's sacrifice was not in vain. Oh, she is dead. As, as is the boy I wanted to recruit. <sighs> you know, there comes a time in every boy's life where he sits next to a plastic tree with some boxes and the wrap point nicely with some ribbons. And he opens them, and he doesn't always get what he wants. And that right there is the true test of what kind of man that boy is going to grow up to be. And if this moment right now were that milestone in, in my life, I, I do believe I'd have to respond with a FOR FUCK SAKE THAT! I JUST WANTED MALIBU BARBERICH! <laughs> And that's the end of the video. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please do like it and share it and all that. Maybe get to 10,000 likes considering the fact that uh, you know, it's another milestone of me breaking my voice. I'm actually uh, yeah, getting through this gosh darn game on the side quests. And feel free to follow me on Twitter and check out the link in the description for both that and uh, merch if you would so choose to actually look at that. And uh, there's three videos on screen. Watch one, watch your. Thank you for watching this at the very least. And hopefully, with any luck, I shall see you in the next one.